Okay, let's talk about the Montgomery Molly Wap. 40 acres and a duel, the fuck around and find out follies, whatever you want to call it. If you're of the opinion that we should not be celebrating violence in any form, please just scroll on and save yourself the time in a block. But let me start by saying this. A lot of the times when you see stuff happening to people of color, especially black people on video, you'll see in the comments like, oh, why didn't anybody do anything? Why didn't anybody do anything? And the answer is because it's usually the cops. And it is a much different proposition when you're talking about going against somebody with a badge and a gun and the weight of the state behind them. It just is. And to like pretend it's not otherwise is like a little silly. And a lot of the times when it's not 12 that does the stuff, it's like a group of these good old boys and they're off in the cut or they catch somebody out of area late at night. That's why there are sundown towns, right? It's not usually a fair one. And they thought they could get away with it in broad daylight and they found that they were wrong and they deserved every blow, especially my friend with the chair. You will live on forever. If you need bail money, like just, just let me know. And right now, this is a moment for black people but like, let's all think about the fact that if we didn't have 12 standing on our necks, we would be more inclined to do stuff. And that right there is an object lesson in why the police are not there to protect us, but to protect the vulture class and to protect capital. Like this is not just as simple as, you know, the ancestors. Like I honestly find it a lot more beautiful that it didn't got nothing to do with the ancestors. It was just us. Like we saw something happening and it was not the cops and it was like okay well here's a chance and i'm not going to miss this chance to actually protect someone when i can you love to see it and it's beautiful and if you think otherwise grab a history book i don't know what to tell you